This past Valentine's Day, while many were giving gifts to their loved ones, Belgium gave its oldest commercial nuclear reactor a kiss goodbye. On February 14, 2025, Dual 1 was officially shut down after 50 years of operation. But while its closure marks the end of an era, there is growing political debate over whether this is truly the final chapter for the reactor. When Dual 1 first came online in 1975, nuclear energy was heralded as a nearly limitless power source. Its construction, alongside Dual 2, was part of Belgium's broader nuclear expansion to reduce reliance on imported oil, particularly after the 1970s oil crisis. By the mid-1980s, Belgium had seven reactors running, with plans for an eighth. However, the 1986 Chernobyl disaster triggered a global shift in attitudes towards nuclear energy, halting further expansion. Formal nuclear phase out law was introduced in 2003, setting an arbitrary 40-year lifespan for each reactor. This is odd because nuclear plants can operate for decades longer than that. Under this policy, Dual 1 was initially scheduled to close in 2015, yet energy security concerns and reactor shutdowns elsewhere forced the Belgian government to reconsider. A 10-year extension pushed the closure to 2025, but with recent power supply worries, political voices are now questioning whether the decision should be reversed again. While Dual 1's fate remains uncertain, its history reflects Belgium's ongoing struggle to balance energy security, economic interests, and public concerns over nuclear power. Will this be the final shutdown, or will necessity once again force the government to reconsider?